You are watching this video because you're wondering if you should add Paper Mario the Origami King to your collection. Well, let's find out. This is my first time playing through the game and you're here with me to watch and discover. I'm super excited about Paper Mario and it's released today and I'm so happy to jump directly into it. So let's do this together to see and learn more about the game. I'm no expectations here. I just want to jump into this and just start and just start playing. So let's see. Oh, that's I think that's a very cool animation. <laughs> okay, Paper Mario, the Origami King. I'm kind of like digging this music. This music is, it kind of hits. I, I can dig with this. It's not something that I can listen like over and over, but I can dig this. It, it has a nice upbeat to it. Hey, okay, well, let's jump right in. <laughs> yes, we we'll use this profile. So I'm super excited. I've been reading a lot on it and watching it up until today. And I just wonder if it's gonna hold my attention. I always give any game at least 30 minutes to keep me, and if it does, it's something that I know I'll continuously play. So we have Mario and Luigi here. Isn't it great, bro? Back on the road again together, heading to some kind of festival, as we can see from the intro there. What did the invitation say again? An origami festival, what's that gonna be like? <laughs> and I can't wait to say hello to Princess Peach. It's a, it's been a while. I was gonna say it's been a peachy day. <laughs> it's good to see like the cart, you know, they're using stuff from other games. See, that was like the Luigi cart. It wasn't the Mario cart. Sure has an L on it. Oh, cool. Everything is all like origami. You got these papers. I think it's pretty cool. So this is my first time playing the Paper Mario series. Ever. I've never played a Paper Mario game. So I, I have very high expectations from the Mario series because Mario has always been fun. So I'm looking forward to this being just as fun and captivating my attention just like the other series. Here we are, Toad Town. And there's Peach Castle. It's so quiet. Where's everybody? Oh my. Where did everybody go? No one's here, it's no one, nothing. Huh. Where's everybody? <laughs> you don't think we missed it, do you? <laughs> Mario, check the invitation again. When were we supposed to be here? Pulling out the invitation. You are invited to an origami festival in fabulous Toad Town. Date OOXX, Peach. <laughs> well, it's the right day, you think? <laughs> They're still getting things ready? Mm. Let's go check. <laughs> Let's go uh, check. Maybe everyone's inside. Maybe. Let's go see. So we're going to take the Luigi cart up inside. Oh, I thought it was making me drive. I was like, oh, what's going on? Why is it taking so long? Oh, it's stuff knocked all over the ground. It looked like something happened. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I don't know if Mario and Luigi has checked that out yet, but... And then the drawbridge is up. What's going on? Look, I'm like looking up, trying to look over it. <laughs> I'm like, oh my God, what can I see? Like I could really look over it. <laughs> oh, I crack myself up sometimes. I really do. Uh... <laughs> Alrighty, we are here at the legendary Peach Castle. Now let's see, I think we're gonna be introduced to our villain right away. I think they're not gonna waste any time at all. It's cool seeing like Mario riding back. Here we are, Peach Castle. <laughs> I'm gonna park the cart, okay? They call it a cart, just like Mario Kart. Ah, <laughs> I don't wanna Tip the valet. Ah. I like how it's all thing. Yep, it's the Luigi card I, I don't mean like, but you know, you get it. You get it. <laughs> there it is. 
I remember the in old Mario games that uh, board that was inside the stained glass window there. Sorry for the wait, bro. Let's go see the princess. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> okay. So here now I'm actually controlling and. Okay, so I'm pressing X, that brings up this menu, and I press B to release it. So to jump, you hit A. Okay. Okay, so I have some basics down. And then I'm pressing A to open. I hate that I have to look down, like, where's A? Where's that? Which one is it? <laughs> this is pretty cool. <laughs> it's kind of spooky in here, isn't it? And where is everybody? I expect to see at least one toad by now. You're right about that. Definitely right about that. Mamma mia! <laughs> I forgot our gift in the cart. I just dash out and get it. Okay, so this is where Luigi is gonna get caught. Uh oh. Well, maybe not. My guesstimation was not correct. Okay, I don't like that. <laughs> How am I gonna get outside? Where's the when the door is locked? Okay. I don't know. You might have an issue there. Don't worry, Mario. <laughs> I know just what to do in situations like this. I bet you do. Uh, you just gotta find. Oh, right, Mario, right? Come on. Oh, so we have some storyline. As usual, you'd normally go through some type of storyline. It's gonna set your foundation or basics for the story. Okay, I'm just gonna take a deep breath and go find the key to this door. That's what you do, right? Like, nah. Tell the Princess Peach I'll be right there if you see her, okay? Bye bye. Bye bye bye. Mamma mia. Okay, so like we're both totally going the same way. <laughs> I can come closer to the screen. I can get back there in the sun. Press A to jump. Yeah, we both definitely went the same way. All right. Mario, is that you? Uh oh. Is this supposed to be Peach? Mario, is that you? Mamma mia! She's been turned into paper! Well, I mean, she was already paper. <clears throat> How good to see you. Ooh. Uh, answer me this. Shouldn't the Mushroom Kingdom unfold and be refolded unto glory? No. So I hit B for no. And what to those toads? Shouldn't they be silence of all for all eternity? No. I wonder what happens if I would have said yes. I see. Last question. Will you cease yourself and be reborn like me? No. Wrong answer. It matters not. Your replies are all paper thin. <laughs> it, it, paper thin. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh no, she left. Oh no, she opened the door. Do we have to fight Peach in this one? Oh, here come all the other paper. Mario! This is crazy because all these are like enemies. Always got to make a flashy interest, huh? <laughs> are you here for the Origami Festival too? It was. This dungeon themed weight lounge is huge upgrade from the last festival I attended. Very classy. <laughs> You ain't seen Master Browser anywhere, have you? Uh-uh. <laughs> I ain't like the big lug to leave us. Minions hanging around at public event. Well, I mean... Whoa, Mario, you're here. It's like everybody know Mario. I'm a big fan. I mean, I always wanted to battle you. Even if you get stumped, I would be. it would be an honor. You silly. Wow, this is all exciting. First, I see the Princess Peach, and now you. <laughs> I gotta say, the princess was a little different than I expected. Less felt like, light left, like left. Li life left. Left. Okay, I won't do it. As you know, come with us. <laughs> yeah, what's next? I've never seen a toad before. Please tell me it's a toad. No, it's not. It's a shy guy. Not you. Uh, hope you don't have to wait too long, Mario. I say hi to Toad for you. Hmm. Do y'all not see what's going on here? 
Mario's thinking. Mario, what are you going to come up with? Mario, is that you? Oh, is that like Princess talking? Who is that? I need your help. I'm, I'm, I'm in a very strange place. Who is this? It's cramped and dark, almost like I'm in between dimensions or something. Hmm. I'm not sure if I should be amazed or scared, but I'm kind of both. If it's not too much trouble, I'd like to get out now. Please, is there any way you can help? Oh, a hammer. Yay. Okay, so I totally have stuff in the way, and I can't see, like, what that said. So, I guess early when I did this, well, that's not it. And I can't see because I have stuff in the way. Huh, ah, great design, Tim. Uh, so I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to use this hammer. Don't know how to do it, so I'm gonna have to figure it out. This, pressing the Z, X, Y, uh, and press B. Nope, that didn't work. Oh, wait. So I'm pressing B, and that's the hammer. So I guess, oh. Are you leaving? It sounds like you're leaving. Please help me. Now let me hit some of these boxes. Could do nothing to that box. So, I mean, oh, what was that? Did something light up at your feet? It is a magical circle. Magic circle. I'm like making up words. Totally. That's good. I think I mean I'm not really sure what you're supposed to do with it. <laughs> Can you try to use something? Ah, oh, let, let me see. Uh, X or folding arms? X. Folding arms. Okie dokie. That sounded good. <laughs> are your arms big and foldy now? Yes, they are. I've heard about this. I think those are the 1,000 folded arms. Okay, 1,000 fold arms. They feel around a bit. Maybe you can help me escape from this strange dimension. It feels like the arms are off-center and you're out of control. Maybe you can try pressing R to reset them. Like I'm like really doing, oh, get to the right. Do you need to start over? Maybe they're trying. Maybe to, more to the left. Just a little lower. A little to, a little higher. Wait, wait. It's like here. I don't know what to do once I do it. All right, so I'm not really getting this. Oh. All right, we saw that. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, this is a little wonky. Ah! Okay, that took a little second. Oh, wow. I'm free from that weird in between dimension. Yeah, that was a little wonky. I don't, I don't know if I like that. Um, oh, I was stuck in the wall, in that wall. Yes, you were. It wasn't a dimension. You must be Mario, yes. My name is Olivia. Olivia Pope is here with us. You'd probably like to know a lot more about me and why I'm trapped like that. Yes, we would probably love to know why you're trapped like that and a little more about you. That would help so much. But I don't think we really have the time for that now. Maybe we should just get out of here. But it's the castle. There's just one thing. I'm not exactly feet or foot. Mind if I hit your ride? I don't get it. I was confused. Okie dokie. So now we have Olivia and we are leaving this area. You know, I feel like I just had a pretty good idea. Mm-hmm. Let me hear it. I don't know if there are always be good ideas, but I'm always happy to share them with you. Okay. Why don't you just try pressing X if you're stuck 
And I'll see if I can think of something useful. Okie dokie. Who knows? Maybe we'll get to know each other and make a great team. Is that how these things go? I don't know. We will find out if that's how these things go. Okay, so like press X, comes out. Oh, thank you for calling me. Calling on me with X. It's my first hint. Now for an act. Draw a hint. Hmm. I'm feeling like a. I'm feeling. I'm feeling like a good hurry is in order. Is there a way to get out of here nearby? Okay. Okay, Olivia's looking around for us. Okay, I'm getting my bearings. Um, I think we might be in the castle dungeon. You think? The dungeon smells like this place smells, right? Okie dokie, yeah, I'm sure. Let's see. Then we have a door over here. Hey, knock it off. So I want to use this hammer. That voice is really scary. Uh, trying to, oh, okay, B. B, 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 use the hammer. I want to get some more stuff because there's more boxes and stuff over here. Press A to check. A. Checking. No, I can't see what you're about to do to my minions, and I order you to cut it out. So it's Bowser. So we're seeing them throwing a turtle. Oh, it turned it into paper. Oh, was that a paper clip? What did you see? Nothing terrifying, I hope. That was the last of them. Oh no. No. Except for the mustached one. Mustachio, because there's an old mustachioed one. Okay. They kind of walk like that. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, I must have to explain one little thing. Those stiff looking guys are called folded soldiers. Folded soldiers? I don't want to alarm you, but they're really unbelievably dangerous, and I think we should try to avoid them. What do you think? They meant by that was the last of them. Anyway, the last what? I don't know, but we can go in here. Press A to open the door. Open the dough and let's see. Mm, get this hammer out real quick. Bam. Oh, press the wrong button. Here we go. See if I can hit this. I can't do nothing to that yet. Oh, it's Bowser. Mario, you're here too? Well, what are you waiting for? Get me down from this thing. <laughs> Even you know this is no way to treat royalty. Are you royalty? Royalty, oh, nice to meet you. Is everyone in your kingdom also this face? Also a face? Uh, I've got a body too. They folded it. Jerks just bit it all the way and wasn't described in detail right now. Uh huh. It. I've seen worse, believe me. I bet you have Bowser. Never mind that. I am a great king. I'm the great king Bowser and I demand to be set free and unfolded. Now, Mario, ignore your floating friend and get me down from here. Bowser commands you. <laughs> I would do the same for you. <laughs> you need me as much as I need you. Admit it. I don't know. Uh, plus, I can tell you a secret after you free me. No one can resist a good secret. Blah, 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 blah. Let me go see if there's other thing. Hey, don't just leave me hanging. Get me down from here. Okie dokie, I guess. So let's go and pull. Oh, I missed. I don't... Here we go. Ow, ow. Okay. Pulled him down. And let's see. Oh, so he can block off it. Oh, kind of thought I'll just unfold or something. Nope. Bah, no matter. <laughs> now, as far as the secret I promised to tell you, there's a hidden exit in this room. All right. I hear those jokes talk about it lousily. No good. Body folk and jokes, jerks. Uh, now hurry up and find it, and I'll let you bring me along when you escape. Uh, of course, OK. 
that. So let's sit here and let's sit the. Oh, we've ever hit the big one. Don't want to use the floating arm. Not yet. Not yet. Let's try it now. Use floating arms. We're going to hit X, though. That was A. That was not X. Let's use X. Okay. Alrighty. Oh, here. So we press both. Ah, uh, so that was a little easier. Huh. See? Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> okay, so let's continue on and have some more fun. You, you're really getting the hang of this thousand-fold arm, Mario. I bet. Fody arms. Let's go up these steps. We haven't seen Luigi. Uh. Saving. Oh, so that's the save point. Save completed. Save completed, huh? Guess that means that your adventure up to this point has been saved. Phew! <laughs> uh, let's make a habit of saving every time we see another one of these shiny blocks, okay? Okie dokie, let's make a habit of that. Uh, oh, and you'll find all sorts of helpful stuff when you open the menu with the plus. Okay, so menu is the plus. <laughs> if you want to try uh, some other options, you'll need to you need some help. Check the, in the menu. Okay, so you press that and you bring out the menu and then you can hit the, so this is the menu. And how do you, uh, ain't like I can get over there to do that. Use for item. Oh, I wasn't reading. And you hit that. Uh oh, I see. Accessory weapons, map, info. Alrighty. Okay, so we looked at the menu. We have a clear understanding of the menu. Let's do it. So pretty much, it's like the first 30 minutes of the game is like all story mode. They're trying to get, they're really trying to set the basis of this and get you to understand what happened, what's going on. So we understand there was a origami festival going on in the town here and somebody came and just destroyed it and started turning people into paper monsters, I guess, or something of the sort. So now we're trying to go and find out more. We're here on top of Peach's Castle to see what else is there to find. Mm-hmm. Uh-oh. Shy guy, Peach. She can see me like this. She can't see me like this. Why are you still so flat? <laughs> Why haven't you joined me and folded glory? I don't know. Come, we can reshape you. Patient princess, this would do just fine. So you're Mario. Princess Peach Hero, right? Mm-hmm. Yes, you'll do quite well. Very crisp, bright colors. I can see it now. Uh-huh. So, what do you say? Will you volunteer your paper body to the cause? No. Or will we have to get crumpy? Join us. Yes or no? No, I will not. Of course. As expected, nothing less. And to be honest, I wouldn't have had it any other way. <laughs> Take a good long look at Princess Peach. She's better this way, don't you think? No need to answer. You'll soon feel the power of origami for yourself. Folded soldier, come forth. Oh, so he's able to order more people. Oh no. I've never seen a folded soldier like that, Mario. Doesn't look like one of your flat paper friends. Uh, I, I guarantee that. I mean, I never got to see Toad. Oh. Oh. Prepare to be folded. Raise battle. Okay, so we're going into a battle. So this is the new battle things and how these work. Oh no, I'm guessing that you're first time facing folded soldiers, Mario. Uh-huh. Once these flat paper folks have been turned into folded soldiers, we can't turn them down. We can't turn them back. Okay, it seems cool to fight them, but if we don't, they'll try to fold you into origami too. Okay. I'd help you attack, but my tiny arms don't pack a punch. Much of a punch. I see. I don't want to get in your way. Okay, thank you so much. Just sit down. Uh, have a few seats. So, I'll cheer you on, but you have to do the heavy lifting yourself, as always. Line them up. And, did you catch that message? They said something about a wave battle. Are we in some kind of splash zone? I don't know. I guess we, hmm, 
worry about that when we get it. Later, let's focus on these enemies for now, Mario. Speaking of, you're surrounded by four folded soldiers, huh? Where did the other three come from? If they're all attacking at once, you'll get a real... Mm, and it looks rough. It doesn't look that rough. Mm. Hey, I just had a great idea. Okay. If you line them all up, you could just jump your way down the road in one attack. Boop, bop, beep, bam. Lucky for us, these wings will let us move the enemies around in a group together. Use, uh-huh, uh-huh, and then press A to confirm your choice. Uh-huh. There's just one naughty Goomba out of place right now. Let's try to get it over to the empty. Okay, uh. Now use L again to rotate the ring and line up the Goomba. Great, so I did that. Yeah, there we go. You lined up all the all four Goombas. I didn't know they were called Goombas, so it's good to finally get some names to them. I just didn't know they were called Goombas, so we can try that. When your group of enemies into when you what? When you group your enemies into a successful lineup like this, your attack power will increase by 1.5%. I'm saying percent, but it says power. Uh, that means your attack power will be precisely. Oh oh gosh, I forgot how to multiply by points. Um, my left is 100% going off and telling me about me. I hear now. Oh, whatever. Ugh, you get what I mean. Your attack would do more damage. Okay, so we're gonna do this. So keep lining them up, lining up the enemies. We lined them up and we can use boots or a hammer. Okay, now we can flatten these goobas with a jump attack. Select your boots and use using L. Okay, so it says L, but I'm pretty sure it means this. And then press A. So we can so I'm up and down here with L and then press A. So now I'm pressing A. Mario's turn. Boop, boop, dig it, dig it. I should have X Man. Yay! Okay, wow. <laughs> those famous oh those World famous Mario jumps don't disappoint. I bet you they don't. You just took out all four Goombas with a single jump attack. You just took out all four Goombas with a single jump attack. Um, <laughs> see what I mean? Lining up your enemies, it's a totally, it's totally worth the effort. I guess, I guess. Last wave, shy guy. Uh, more folded soldiers. More folded soldiers. Uh, I guess some battles are gonna have enemies attacking in waves. Okay, so that's what they meant by wave. Oh, I guess that's what you're not gonna say the same thing I'm gonna say. I guess that must be why this is what's called a wave battle up front. <laughs> if you see the last wave pop up, that must mean that you're on the last group. Hang tough, Mario. Okie dokie. These guys are all lined up a little differently, so show me your hammer attack next. Uh, line them up. Uh, your hammer attack will hit shorter, wider areas with one powerful blow. Okie dokie. Alright, so it's a lot of explanation here, but I really don't need all this. It's way too much. I just wanted to get into playing. I would rather figure it out by doing than getting directions. I'm one of those that don't need the directions. Let's give it a try. Same as before. Select the ring. L and then press A to confirm. Okie dokie. So we're gonna do that and then we're gonna. So I'm pressing left and right to actually get it to happen. And I press that, line them all up. Uh, I wanna really always like have the circles there to tell me this is how you do it, this is how you get 1.5 times the power. Okay, so now we're gonna select the hammer. Same thing as we did last time. So I really don't need this repeated for me. We're gonna select the hammer and it's my turn. So they get to do something or a move or something like that and then I get to do a move. I wonder how this is gonna work out in the future. Did you see that? Blah, ah, what a satisfying attack. Good. Fast, flashy, and flattening, but only if you arrange your enemies into a successful lineup. Jump attacks and hammer attacks both have their own ideal lineups. Okay, 
Always think carefully about how your enemies are lined up before you attack, okay? Uh-huh. Ooh, we got, we got money. I need money! So we were able to get some money for the battle. Now we have 450, and then we're destroyed. So I wonder if the yellow side guy is going to come to us. So you defeated the first Goomba. Bravo. I assure you, oh, far from the deadliest creature in this realm. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I suppose there's no point in maintaining this any longer. Okay, let's do, do what you're going to do. And is this the origami game? So he folded himself. He folded himself. Okay. Brother! Oh, so this Olivia. No, it can't be. I didn't want to believe it could be you. No. How many times did I tell you to stop? Please. You have to stop now. I'm kind of getting bored. It's way too much. Um, why could Mario have simply left you in that wall where I put you? Oh, so that's where you were. Sister, if you stand in the way of my ambition, I'm afraid you will not share in my glory as family. Disrespectful much. Oh, and by the way, uh-huh, uh-huh. I am no longer your brother. Ooh, I am King Ori. Hmm. So he can fly? Can, are we able to fly? Is that like PP or something like that? By the time I'm done, all of those miserable toads will be folded. No, the toads will be folded. The flimsy paper minions of browser shall be reborn as loyal folded soldiers serving me. Ooh, now he's telling us his plan. And I shall fold, cease, and bend the entire paper world to my whim. The birth of a new origami kingdom. Okie dokie, so now we have the plot. And now we see your true power. Ooh, women, it's folding the whole world. Da 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 da. Uh oh, the whole castle is getting wrapped in paper. This paper is so pretty, it's like a party, a river party. Yay! Here come Bowser, like, ah, 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 ah. Oh. This is cool. Nice little cutscene here. And it's probably good to see like Mario and Bowser work together for something for a change. So I guess they're gonna have to get like the magical scissors to like cut all this off to get back into the castle. Ah. Uh, oh no, it's taking the castle completely by storm. Hmm. Look at this, look at this. Olivia's absolutely scared. Oh, uh, Luigi! No! We forgot about him. He's in the castle. Uh oh. Is Mario falling to his death? No, Mario, come back. Oh. I mean, you didn't take you didn't take the castle that far. I mean, I thought it was gone forever. Okay, so that brings up up to 30 minutes of gameplay. For the first 30 minutes of the game, it's definitely laying the basis and giving you the foundation of what's actually going on in the kingdom. As you saw, there's or the origami king, Orly, who basically came and like folded Princess Peach and some other people so that he can make this whole origami kingdom. We met Olivia, and we actually ran into Bowser where he became a frenemy of ours and as we continue with the story. So that little cut right there kind of made me more interested into the storyline. Um, I definitely would have to play a lot more for me to perfectly assess it. Based on a little bit that we played, the question you probably would have for me, would I suggest to tell someone to buy it? This is 30 minutes of gameplay. Right now I cannot I cannot assess or give you enough information to tell you to buy it from 30 minutes of gameplay. So let's continue playing a little bit more, a little bit later. And you can see part two where we're able to get more of the gameplay. And we can probably assess it more. The controls feel, it's, I would say it's not actual natural. Especially when we were ripping the paper from the wall. I had some, just a little bit of difficulty. So it's really based on where you are. Maybe I'll reposition uh, the switch a little bit more to see if I can get that feeling a little bit better where I'm able to do that a little bit easier. I haven't played enough of the wave battles 
for me to give you a true assessment of that. But you were able to see the first 30 minutes of the game. So with that dealing, will I play more? Yes. Uh, will I still would have bought it this far? Yes, I still would have bought it. So I'll see you in the next number two gameplay of the game where I'm able to give you more information on whether or not I would buy this game or not. If you like this video and would like to see more gaming content from yours truly, smash that subscribe button. And for the gaming connoisseur you are, I prepared these videos for you.